Okay, I'm going to make a real quick video for you of how to transfer your vocabulary from Poloqua to go from one device to another. Um, the first thing that I need you to do is to make sure that you have the Dropbox app downloaded onto your device and that you have a Dropbox account. Um, so we're going to go ahead and open up Proloquo to go and down at the bottom where settings button is, we're going to go ahead and press that and we're going to go all the way down to the bottom where it says back up. The first thing that we're going to need to do is back up the user that we want backed up. So I'm going to back up Abby's and I'm going to press back up Abby. So now, now that um, the vocabulary is backed up, now we want to export it. So we're going to go under back backups and click on export backups and then you'll notice at the top that there's a Dropbox integration you have to turn on so make sure you have your Wi-Fi turned on and you turn that on it takes you right to the Dropbox app asks you if you'll allow Proloquo to go to make a folder in it and you'll click allow it takes you right back to Proloquo to go you look at your backups and pick the one usually the latest one that you want to export and then it asks you where you want to export it to so you're going to press export to Dropbox and then it shows you a bar um, of the progress of it exporting to Dropbox. Now I'm going to go to my other device that I want to put the vocabulary that I've made on the other device onto this one so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open up my Dropbox app and I'm going to go to apps that's the folder that Proloco to go um, created. And you'll see our assistive word created because I also have a Pictello folder from doing this with Pictello as well. But I'm going to go ahead and click on Proloco to go. I'm going to see my vocabularies that I have saved on Dropbox. I'm going to select the one that I want um, on this device. And then you'll see this come up that it's unable to view file. And so what you have to do is go up in the very top corner and press the um, little arrow. And then it gives you the option to open it up with Proloco to go. So I'm going to touch that. And it is exporting the file to Proloco to go right now. And so it says, do I want to restore now or do I want to restore later? So if you don't want to restore it right now, um, if you want to restore it to a different vocabulary that you have open right now, then make sure you press later. But I want to restore it to the vocabulary that I have right now. Um, so I'm going to press restore now. And it's asking me, do you want to restore this to the folder that I have called Abby? And I do. So I'm going to hold and press that button and it will restore to the new vocabulary. You won't see much of a difference because there was only a couple buttons changed and we're all done. So I hope that helps. Please leave any um, questions you have in comments and I'd be happy to answer them and make sure to go to assistiveware.com for more in-depth um, information on how to back up and restore all the different ways that you can do that. Thanks guys.